Mike Morales here, and uh, Alex Vieco of Montavo Tequila, the brand owner, brought this to my attention when we met uh, not too long ago. He asked me on, over the phone before we met, he said, Mike, do you aerate your tequila? I said, well, we, uh, you know, open it up, s swirl it a little bit. We want to make sure that it, it blooms like a glass of wine. And he said, uh, no, he says, do you use a, an aerator? And I said, well, I've, I've seen those for the wine industry, but I didn't know that they made one for spirits. And so he brought this nifty little item called the Venturi Aerator. And uh, in our blog, we'll explain a little bit more about what the actual principle it's based on, but what it does is it actually shoots air into your tequila or spirit, you know, your scotch, your rum, and um, it, it opens it up. Uh, and the only way to really try these these items is to actually taste it. So take a look at what we're going to do here. You, you, you see the Venturi aerator here. This one has a nice uh, base to it. Uh, I believe it's glass, uh, not acrylic. And, and you see the measurements. This one's a branded uh, version for Montavo tequila. You see their little logo there. But you see the, the measurements for the, for the spirit. So what we're going to do is we're going to try this first with Montavo tequila. And we're also going to use um, one other tequila that we have listed here. So right there at the line, we'll just try a small portion of that. And you can you can see the presentation of this item. It's it's actually quite elegant. It would sit very nicely on a on a on a bar with a decanter, for instance, a nice bottle of tequila, and of course a, a Riedel or champagne glass. In this case, we're using a champagne glass. And simply all you do is you raise it. Take a look at it. Try not to tip it a little bit too much. I'm trying to do this one-handed here, folks, so bear with me. And this little lever aerates. It shoots air through it and releases it into your glass. Check this out. All right. And just that little motion, uh, based on a physics principle, which we'll discuss in the blog a little bit further in the text, and voila your sample has been aerated. Now, if you take a, a, a sip before and after, there is a definite, definite difference in your spirit. And the best that I can explain it is that it's a bit brighter and it disperses a, 